All right, so hey guys, and welcome to a game called Dark Fracture. I know that recently we've been posting a decent amount of indie horror games here on the channel. Typically, I don't like to do it because I don't really enjoy 100% doing horror games all the time, but I know that a lot of you guys have been enjoying them and it's been getting some pretty good feedback. So I thought today we start off our Monday with a nice little indie horror game, if you will. I try to remember the entire like brief synopsis of this game, but it's really early and I, you know, my brain's not properly working right now. So I'm just going to go ahead and read it off of Steam here. And it says the following. Dark Fracture is an indie psychological horror game played in first person. During the course of the game, the player is faced with the character's inner chaos, witnessing the world change around him as the barrier between reality and imagination seems to crumble. Yeah. His broken mind leaked his fractured soul into a dark, endless labyrinth. In the eternal night, he longed for respite from the loneliness, only to realize he had never really been alone. Sure, I guess. <sighs> okay. Got some pills on the desk. How long was I out? I uh, like, like a it. cigarette. Yes. Where's my yes, damn indeed. lighter? prologue dark nights i guess if the ghosts don't kill me my cigarette will huh smoke away that cancer sir will ya okay so graphics look pretty good it is done with unreal engine for those of you that are wondering if you were even wondering at all can i turn it off yeah, let's turn that off. Let's turn that off. So we've got personal medication. My psychiatrist tells me it is used for severe mental illness that do not improve. I've been consuming these for several years now. Common side effects which I'm experiencing are drowsiness, low blood pressure, blurred vision, and dizziness. At least we know that some side effects are not seeing dead people. That's always good. Okay, so I would assume we got to get out of here. What is this? Okay, we can rotate and T to throw. Oh yeah, it's locked. Where did I leave the key? A new journal entry, press tab to examine. I just remember that I had locked the door to the office before my nap, just in case someone came in and caught me off guard. I remember placing the key in one of the desk drawers. Oh, fuck that. I hate games that allow you to turn off lights. I don't like that. So tab to open up the inventory items which you collect throughout the game will be kept there. If you are unsure what to do next, check your journal notes. Okay. Oh, there's the key. Okay, we've got the key. The key to the office. I will use that. That's the office enough. key. Where's my lighter? So most doors and drawers are interactive. Some of these are locked and can only be opened by specific keys. Okay, what about this? These drawers. Can we open up the... Okay, these are interactable. That's locked. It's jammed, better yet. Okay. Get stuffed potato chips are my favorite brand. Yummy and crunchy as fuck. Too bad this bag is empty. Open up the door. It's been unlocked. It's a little dark and in here. Maybe I should turn the lights on. Oh. Uh, Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa there. Slow down, Junior. How do I turn on the lights? <sighs> what the hell is this place? I was hoping to walk into like some sort of conference building, not a fucking mental institute. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Okay, this is very creepy. Where's my freaking lighter? I should find my lighter, right? Let it, hold on. <laughs> Where's my fucking lighter, dude? Okay, my lighter is it here? Got some uh, Martar Martar Martardo. I smoke about a pack of these daily, and I truly do not believe you can work here unless you're a heavy smoker. It's a habit, and whenever I manage to visit the town, I buy as many as I can since the fat. Uh, the facility is so isolated, but hey, 
At least they're cheap. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I'm gonna head up this way. God. What the fuck was that? Oh, fuck me. Fuck. I would need to finish the shift down here before I even think about leaving. Okay, so that's to leave. Okay, some something someone doesn't want me to leave. My sanity went down, and as you can see, we have a sanity bar, which means you can either survive or fucking die. Where's this stupid lighter at? It's probably not even here, bro. I'm just wasting my time. Um, analysis of the human mind, the secret. Oh, fucking hey, dude. You know what? This next door looks... The section isn't available during early access gameplay. Okay, thank you. Okay, neither is this. It's jammed. So I guess we're just gonna... Walk on by the middle of the hallway. I don't know what the fuck that was back there, but that was scary as fuck. It's jammed. Okay, I'm actually very... I would rather smoke and check in on dead bodies. I've got to be honest, I'm kind of happy that most of these, most of these doors are not, uh, openable. It means I have less options to be scared shitless of. Okay, we've got another desk here, another key, and a letter. Specimen report 37544. It's a very interesting case. She's still up there in one of those outdoor cases, cages, I'm sorry. I will need to check on all of them when rainstorm passes. The key to my locker, it's an old and rusty. Uh, it's old and rusty. I'm always, uh, I've always wondered how many people have held it before me. Edward's locker key. My locker key. I'm gonna slide it in on my office keychain. Okay, now where are the lockers? I wanna say they may be inside here is where we'll find our lighter. Okay, new entry to examine. The changing room is such a mystery. So many former employees left their belongings behind and never came back to collect them. It is almost like they did not know they were not coming. They weren't coming back or were in a real big hurry. It's weird either way. Anyway, I gotta get back to my locker. Yeah, this is. <laughs> what type of game is this, man? Huh? All these people that left their belongings here, Edward. They're dope. Fuck, that's a key. <sighs> the key to the office. Uh, I've attached my locker key to this keychain to make life easier. Well done. Edward's locker. Yeah. Home sweet home. Well, my lighter. <laughs> a metal lighter I usually carry around with me. Uh, it has a limited capacity of lighter fluid. Of course it does. And needs to be refueled every now and then. So I should only use it when necessary. That's just fantastic. The lighter is used as a secondary source of light if you have limited amount of fluid in your lighter. So use it, uh, you have a limited amount of fluid on your lighter, so use it wisely. It may be temporarily affected by environmental factors and other events. Press one to equip or unequip your lighter. Oh crap, I almost forgot about the pill. <laughs> I needed to take the oxyotene pill from my locker. This small, shady-looking uh, red and white capsule. I've got plenty more upstairs. Not that I ever want any more of these. And I need to consume them daily if I want to continue working here. Facility medication. The administration here requires all staff to consume this pill daily with strangely specific directions they claim the pill is for. Staying mentally alert on the job and the daily ritual centers our, our, centers our thoughts or focuses the mind or something to that effect. So are we working uh, in some... I better do it the way they asked. Because with all these cameras around it, it feels like they're watching my every move. Okay, hey, where the hell are we actually working? A key to the exit facility upstairs. I've got a long shift to go, so I cannot think about leaving just yet. I would definitely get fired if I do. And I really need to keep this job. Do you really? Do you really need to keep this job? I don't think so, Edward. Edward, by the time you read this, I would have no longer been in your life. 
I've changed my phone number, taken my belongings, and will be staying in a hotel for a short while. I left your keys on the desk. I won't be needing them anymore. I just cannot ca uh, watch you do this. I loved you, Edward. I still love you. And that is exactly why I cannot stomach seeing this. I cannot help you if you fight me at every turn, and I won't stand by while you destroy yourself. Destroy us. I know I'm being selfish. I know this must hurt, but I'm hurting too. And no matter how many times we spoke, my words never reached you. I'm sorry it has to be this way, but I know that if I tried saying goodbye in person, I would have changed my mind. So before that happens, I'm leaving. Goodbye. Oh, you just about messed it all up, didn't you, Edward? Because you wanted to work in this silly ass job. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to close all of the lockers except mine. I'm going to leave that one open just in case I got to come back. Uh, take the pill. They are watching. <laughs> Bro, where, it, where in the world are we? Seriously. <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to say... Okay, that door does not open. The autopsy room. I've got no business in there. Tell me I got business in the bathroom? Ah, uh, is that what you're telling me? Okay, this is not the right... What, what type of workplace has a toilet looking like this? What if I gotta take a dump? How am I gonna take a dump there? I'm gonna cut my ass cheeks. It seems to be locked. Why would it be locked? Somebody in there? No? <laughs> okay. The bathroom is definitely not where I'm supposed to be then. Oh, that's the women's bathroom. Oh. I wasn't supposed to be there in the first place. Okay, we're in the men's bathroom now. <laughs> Hello, anybody out there? I'm just gonna skip the pill tonight. We'll see what happens. Throwing it away. Edward, what the fuck are you doing? Sanity. Many random paranormal events will occur throughout Dark Fracture. Your sanity will be strained by such events. Your, your actions will also affect your sanity. Try to preserve it to get through the game. Okay. Holy freaking hell, dude. Alright, well, you know what? I'm just gonna leave now, you know? I'm just gonna head out the boys' bathroom, and I'm gonna go back to the main hallway, alright? So just, uh... Is that blood? What is that? It's like dry blood? Now we gotta worry about Edward's sanity, huh? <laughs> oh, God. Long hallways. <laughs> Why don't you? I just <laughs> fucking love it. This is great. Oh, we can lean. Oh, nobody told me that. Nobody told me I can lean. Section isn't available in the early access gameplay. How about this one? That one either? It's locked. Great. All right. Now we are in the locker under the storage room. Welcome to the storage room, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. A couple of boxes. Nothing that we can interact with. Everything seems to be totally fine. Wait. Where the hell are my cigarettes? Seriously? I left the cigarettes behind in the office? Fuck. Cynthia, I miss you. Well done, Edward. Going for a smoke break and leaving your cigarettes in the office. Who knows? Maybe you'll leave your keys behind in a, cada in a cadaver. Next. <sighs> okay. I'm just gonna laugh it off because I already know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna... Fuck. What is this? Yeah, those are the breakers. We're definitely gonna come back. And, uh, there's... What the hell is this? Oh, fuck. Okay, I what? Have no, I don't remember it ever being here. Movable objects. Many objects in the game are interactive and some can be moved around. Oh god. Fuck is this? Oh, what the fuck is that? Fuck off.
Yo, what the frick was that, dude? Okay. Okay, I don't know if I'm supposed to be carrying this valve handle. Oh, now the phone's well, ringing. I had the office rings. Probably an important call. Oh, really, Edward? Huh? Is it? Is it now? Is it an important call? Is it? Shit! Missed the call. I should probably get back to work. New journal entry. Press the tab to examine. Damn, I missed the call. It might have been important. Someone is probably gonna come uh, in to check on me. I'd better be. Bi um, I'd better get busy. What I recall, there are six bodies occupying the freezers in the freezer's room. A routine checkup is in order. I still got a few more hours to spend down here until my shift ends. But when I'm done, I should also check on the de uh, decom decomposition process in the outdoor cages. That's This, this is a fucking morgue. Wait, what? Where's the freezer at? Oh. I'm required to move both trolleys out of the room before opening the freezers. Movable objects okay. can be rotated. Now for the second trolley. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, come over here, trolley. Come over here. I'm over here. Yep, yep, yep. Over here. Just not in the hallway. You're gonna interrupt. Yep. I'm gonna put you right, right this way, trolley. Right this way. Yep. I totally hate this game already. I will put you right there. I'm gonna go back into the freezer where the dead bodies are at because this is exactly where we want to be right now, right? Not. I don't want to be in here. Fuck. Come on, stop with the bullshit. Stop with the mind games. This is not funny. Now that this is done, I can go check the occupied freezers. The occupied freezers. Okay, hold on. <laughs> you better believe I'm not going to leave that right there in the entrance or exit because as soon as something happens your boys get a bucket out of there okay the occupied freezers okay that was not too hard our freezers a3 a5 b8 blah 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 should all be occupied it will only take a minute to do a routine check on them hopefully the rainstorm will continue i really don't feel like checking on the decomposition process okay okay a5 B13 and A15. A15. Yeah, there's not a body in there. What? Fucking hell. Body is missing from the freezer. Fuck. Yep. 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 Better use the office phone to report this immediately. Yep. Absolutely. Right now. There's a there's a missing body in the freezer. Relax here, pal. Let's just, just take, take your fucking pill, dude. Your sanity's going to shit. Maybe uh, he thinks he's being real funny, but I don't. Who the fuck was that? Uh, was that on the line? Where's it coming from? There's a camera shutter literally going off right now. 
You think this is a joke? Huh? You think this is funny? Hey, who's there? <laughs> Let's get a laugh. Oh, fuck. What in the world? This body should be here. This is messed up. Oh, Lord. Now, what the frick is going on here, dude? There's a fucking... Okay, that's the body, right? That's missing. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm fucking scared, bro. <laughs> okay, this camera is often used to photograph the deceased during an autopsy and to document the progress of decomposition. It has bright flash light attached to it. Camera flash. Oh my god. Unlimited source of light. Oh my god. Can we like unzip this? Although the camera is unlimited, I still do feel like the lighter is a better light uh, source of light. But that's just me. Okay, anyway, so the camera shutter was triggering itself. Something must be going on here. Uh, hi? Oh, what the fuck out of shit! Now what? Power's fucked. What did I tell you? What the fuck did I tell you? Oh my god. Oh my, dude, this is not good. Okay. <laughs> fuck me. <laughs> oh, fuck. I should probably use my lighter. It's really dark. Oh fuck. Lighter and light and the camera? Sure, why not? Oh. Hi, what the fuck is happening Where here? Where the hell am I? Oh. Uh, Yeah, uh, Edward, you're gonna need to take your fucking pills like right now, kid. Okay, hold on. Don't get it. The fuse box seems okay. Let me try the emergency lights. Hopefully, all the emergency lights are working now. I should locate my medication quickly. Okay, where's the medication? Emergency lights are on. They do not provide much illumination and only operate in small parts of this facility. But it's better than nothing. Now that I can at least see where I'm going instead of uh, grabbing around in the dark, this is a good chance to go and grab my medication that is kept in the cabinet in the office. Should have taken their damn medication in the first place when working in a place like this. Oof. Oh, God. Step at a time. Edward? Oh, what the fuck? Edward, 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 Edward! This isn't happening. Keep it together. We can get through this. This isn't real. Oh, fuck. Okay, yep, I'm, I'm going to my office. <laughs> I'm going straight to my office. what happens when you don't take your medication, stupid. Take your damn medication, Edward. I hope you have learned your lesson. Here it is. Here it is. Okay. Uh, you I really need my medication. Okay, used to restore your some sanity. It can be found in game in random spots, but this is very uncommon. 100% sanity. Let's go, baby. We are totally 
A-okay -okay now. Oh, oh fuck, no, we're not. No, we're fucking not. Another earthquake? <laughs> what the fucking earthquake? <laughs> what the fuck is that? Oh. Yeah, sure. Um, the guy with mental illness problems and a fucking... Okay, fuck it. I'm getting out of here. The exit key is in my locker. Okay, let's let's bounce. Yep, Edward, that's the smartest thing you said all day. And I'm with you on that one, pal. We're out of here. There's a dead body lurking around, and there's some sort of evil entity up at this bitch that I do not uh I'm not very fond of. Look at look at this. They're blocking. Where's the lighter? The key's not here. What? Where's the key? I saw it here earlier. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, no. Okay. So at least I found the key. I'm getting out of this fucked up place right now. this Edward you've got this man you're totally fine your sanity is worth a billion dollars you need to get your ass your lighter won't light up are you kidding me right now But since it seems like I'm stuck here anyway, I don't think I'd want to just sit around while things happen all around me. Well, that's just fantastic. Hey, Edward. <laughs> We've got a situation here, Edward. I think we're fucked. Dude, I hate this shorter flash thing because, like, out of nowhere, something could just pop out. This is actually a really genius idea for a horror game. Oh fuck. Oh fuck! Oh no, oh no. Yo, is that a fucking eye on the wall? What is that? The earthquake must have caused the walls to crumble. Looks like some sort of handle could fit here, but <gasps> what? The handle that was here. Where'd I drop it? I dropped this. Uh oh, fuck, 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 fuck. No, 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 Relax. I dropped the handle here somewhere. Wait. 
Oh. Okay, this here we go. Such a terrible idea. Yep. <laughs> Not good. What the fuck is this? Okay. Lost my mind. Where am I? I have no idea, Edward, but you are fucked. Yeah, Edward, I think we're fucked, dude. That's the exit right there. Yo, I need my pills! <laughs> Give me my pills! <laughs> Give me my damn pills! Throw that over there or fucking. There we go. Here we go. Woo! We're out of here, baby! Let's go! <sighs> Something's gonna happen right before I know it. Just romantic. What in the world is this? This must be a nightmare. What the hell is going on? No, Edward, this is what happens when you don't take your damn prescriptions. PX number 4D. What? My sanity is at 2%? What the fuck? Did we die or what the hell happened? <laughs> I think we were stuck inside a morgue, a haunted morgue, a demonic morgue, and we somehow survived. It was interesting, pretty interesting. Um, I would have had liked to, well, we did see some sort of like entity or something, but I would have liked to seen uh, maybe like the dead body come at us or something, even though that would have been terrifying. I think it would have been uh, pretty interesting to see. In case you are wondering, this is only like a beta. It's a preview build. Dark Fracture, the full game will be releasing eventually later on. I think it's 2021 or something. I'm not sure, but it was definitely, uh, definitely interesting. And I guess uh, there you have it. <laughs> Let me know what you thought. Um, honest opinions in the comments below. It had a lot of tight spaces. Um, it was sometimes predictable, but the, the parts that weren't predictable were pretty scary. And I'm just glad it's over. So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, drop it a like, and I'll catch you later.